What's up guys, welcome back to another video. It is Friday morning, I just got a coffee. We went to Periwink, if you guys are local, it's on the way to the beach and it's super good. They have like really tiny ice cubes, which I do like, but they melt so fast and I drink coffee really, really slow. So that's the only like downside to the small ice cubes. I got an oat milk ice latte and I always get half decaf, half sweet with either vanilla or coconut. But yeah, we've been doing like a Friday coffee date every single week and it's just been like a fun little way to like end the week got a blueberry muffin and then also stopped at the mailbox and i have some packages so i'm gonna go in and open these they've been there for days i didn't even know they were delivered so i don't know how i'm gonna get all this ben just walked outside so that's how okay these i'm not actually i will open them up and show you guys but long story short we had a wedding in the winter actually and we were up back home in pa and i needed shapewear like last second and we went to target and they had like nothing like this place was a disaster they had like you were like looking on the floor for like stuff i don't know what happened to the rack but ben actually found me a pair and they're just a random pair of like jockey shapewear but they have become my favorite shapewear like i just wear them if i need any shapewear with a dress and i got them in, I have them in black and I got them in um, tan for like the wedding weekend. I think I'm gonna get a second pair, but I just wanted to make sure they made them the same way. But I got a small, I wish they had extra small, they don't. But I love how thick the band is, if you guys see what I mean. Like, I feel like some shapewear has a small band and like the way my body is and the way my hips and my um, like just my stomach are like it just feels like it digs in and like cuts me off and this makes it just feel like very seamless So I'll link these below they're like 14 bucks But if you're looking for like a good simple pair of shapewear I also like that they're thongs because I don't like shorts. I feel like it like flattens my butt Okay, and then I mentioned this in my last video, but I got two dresses from selfie Leslie potentially for my thursday or friday night of the wedding weekend it would probably be for thursday night which was our rehearsal night it's like a i think there's a name for this kind of dress i don't know it's like puffy at the bottom like i don't know which is funny to me because and kendra keeps laughing at me because she's like i don't know what's gotten into you with this whole wedding like i never wear girly like bows or ruffles or anything like that but i'm like I feel like this is the occasion to do it and I want to feel like girly obviously as a bride. So this is the one dress. It's kind of like fallen short sleeves. Like they're not like short sleeves. They just kind of like fall. This one, I'll oh, stand up and show you guys. It's like kind of a similar vibe with like, that is like really low though. With the sleeves, but then it's a maxi. I thought that could also be really cute with my hair up. So, I'm gonna make breakfast though. I don't even usually have coffee anymore until I eat, but when we go get coffee, I like to like wake up and go get coffee, you know what I mean? So, it is time to eat. Pretty much the most boring breakfast ever. What do we call that breakfast? Ben's was looking much more balanced <laughs> like an hour or two of computer work and emails send some of some of which is for like website design and graphic design and stuff like that and some of it is for the wedding <laughs> shorts because I'm going to do a treadmill circuit so some combination of like running incline walking regular walking incline running something of that sort I have to write it out wearing a little neutral set like I said in my last video maybe I didn't even say I might have cut that clip out but I love running in biker shorts I just think they're so comfy to run in and then a big t-shirt because I always work out in a big t-shirt because we're just like in our garage and people are always walking by and stuff but it is like 12 30 so going to work out and then i don't really know what i'm going to do because it's not that nice out and i like planned my work this week around having an afternoon today in the sun so we will see what i get into but i'm going to work out <laughs> I'm 
treadmill circuits like that like every single day years ago like as my cardio I also just like like cardio which I know is weird I think it's because of playing sports literally my entire life I just love the feeling after and like my body responds to cardio super well like I just feel so good from it and I think it probably has to do with sports but then at the same time like I know so many girls that love lifting because of sports so I don't know but Point being is that that circuit was great. And then I did a couple circuits of Ben's workout and then did like two random rounds of a circuit that I just did at the end. You guys know the drill, it is time for my post-workout element. We are going with raspberry today, the best flavor there is. I'm gonna mix it. All right, I showered. This lighting makes us look so bad, but so does this lighting so I'm not really sure but I made just a super simple turkey chili last night for dinner because we had like a ton of peppers to use we had turkey um, I had like all the ingredients in the closet this has been a staple recipe for us for so many years it's so easy I'm going to make a recipe video for it like probably in the next couple weeks because it's like such a good fall recipe obviously ate and then cleaned up for like 45 minutes i just had like laundry to put away towels to wash um dishes to do and just some like little things to put away i also have to go in and just like go through all of my shower cards still because i got a check from like two of my aunts that i still haven't deposited which i know is kind of rude because people like I feel like that generation just likes to like balance their checkbooks and like do all that kind of stuff. Um, so I need to go through all those cards. I ended up kind of just doing health stuff this afternoon. I mean, by the time I got done with my workout and ate and showered and then cleaned up, it's three o'clock now. Um, I also cleaned out the fridge because I don't know, like a lot of our veggies must not have been like early on in their ripeness when we bought them this week because a lot of our vegetables went bad, which is kind of frustrating, but all good what are you gonna do yeah I kind of made some plans for us this weekend because <laughs> I feel like every weekend comes around and we're like what do you want to do do you want to go out to eat do you want to cook do you want to go out to eat do you want to cook and we just go back and forth those two things and it just almost like takes the fun out of it do you know what I mean it's like picking a movie like you're like oh let's sit down and watch a movie and then you spend 45 minutes deciding on a movie and then at that point you're like I don't even want to watch a movie that's how we are on the weekends with our plans. We usually have him make the executive decisions and this today I was just like, I am making the executive decision. So I came up with the idea. I'm like in the mood for Mexican, but I'm not really in the mood to like dress, get dressed up to go out to eat. So I'm gonna get ingredients to make steak tacos, have a Corona cause we have Corona and just like have a nice night at home. The weather has been like so nice here recently and I kind of just wanna like chill outside, play a game, do whatever. And then we used to do bacon Saturdays. Um, I don't know why like that became a thing, but we would have bacon every Saturday and Ben has been craving pancakes. That's like his thing. Like, you know how you have like your breakfast thing, like my sweet thing would be French toast. His is pancakes and he hasn't stopped talking about them for like three weeks now and we just haven't had them so i was like we'll go to the store get bacon we'll get pancake ingredients to make like the real deal pancake and then i think we're gonna golf tomorrow afternoon but that's totally beside the point point is is that i wanted to clean the fridge also because we're gonna have to go get ingredients for steak tacos and for bacon saturday so go do the card situation and Ben should be done by the time I'm done with that and then we'll probably go to the store and I will check back in when we're doing so. We have everything prepped. So I made like an avocado salsa, I guess you could call it. I don't really know what to call it. It's like chunky avocado, red onion, garlic, jalapeno, and then lime and salt. And then Ben made a sriracha aioli. We have lime and cilantro for the top. And then these are the wraps that we got. Then so got, I don't know how to say it. I always say it wrong. Cotija. 
is Cotija. Babe, how do you say this cheese? How do you say this cheese? How do I say what? Cojita. Cojita? Cojita. Really? He's gonna be silent. But it's T A T I J A. So it's Cotija. 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 Anyway, we got this. So yeah, that's our little steak taco lineup. Steak tacos. They are done. We have steak. Well, I just showed you guys literally everything that's on them. They look so good. They're gonna be so good. This morning, <laughs> my bun is really, really high. Um, I was gonna end the video last night, but I didn't really end it, and I figured I would do a little taste test of the oat milk that I got. A little bit of this hazelnut. I, I don't know, I could make espresso. Ben's about to make espresso, but we have this cold brew left that's from like five days ago, which at this point is basically espresso. So I'm gonna use that and well, then, use yeah, because it needs used, anyhow. So, okay, honestly, I feel like I don't need that much. Mmm. Oops, guess you're gonna have to add more cold brew. This is so sweet. Wow, that's good. That's so good. Oh, it's like literally just like oats gum, which is like already but it's fine. Hydrolyzed oats are just oats. Okay. I probably didn't even need the hazelnut because that's kind of sweet, but cheers to trying it. Mmm. Good? Mm-hmm. That's so good. Exactly. I wanted a little more coffee. -y. Yeah, I feel like I would use this more as a creamer, not as a milk. That is so good. Here we have some bacon, pancakes. We used our new griddle that I got at my bridal shower, which worked wonderfully. And then some eggs, syrup. We love this one from Whole Foods. Bacon Saturday, baby. Bacon Saturday. Yum. But I have a busy day. We're leaving for Pennsylvania tomorrow morning. It's currently Tuesday. It's 11.30. Um, we're going up there for like six days for my friend's bridal shower and also just to like get some wedding stuff done. Um, that's, yeah, that's pretty much the whole point of the trip. I just got my nails done. I did another wedding trial because the first two that I did well, the one I did for my bridal shower, I liked, but I wouldn't do it for my wedding. And my first trial that I did, I liked, but it was like too pink. And I wanted a little more white. So this is three coats of Funny Bunny. And then I asked for a round almond because I didn't want it to be too pointy. And he said that that's called a tapered oval. I'm like, okay, I don't know like any of the terminology here, but I love these and this is definitely what I'm gonna get for the wedding, so that's exciting. And then I got my toes done for the wedding, like as a wedding trial too, because you are gonna see my feet kind of, because I have a slit. And I don't really, like I don't mind it, but I wouldn't get it for the wedding, so I think I'm just gonna get this to match my toes. So, that is that. I have to go home and get on a meeting. I'm doing, Ben's like in this whole new business and I'm doing the website for it to have a meeting with that group of people, which is kind of intimidating because um, they're like these like big business guys, but it's fine. Like it helps that Ben is like doing it with me. Like he has to get on the calls with me because they all like to talk about like how they want the website, but it's just kind of intimidating. So I'm going home to do that. I have to pack a prep chicken salad to make sandwiches for the car tomorrow. I wanna to work out. I have to go to the post office. We just have a busy day of like a lot of little things to get done. I just got done working out and I am prepping some chicken salad for the car tomorrow. We always make sandwiches and like take some snacks for the car. Um, so one, we don't have to stop and like add time. We like to like make good time. We kind of got like conditioned to do that when we did the Florida drives cause they were so long. But we also just don't really love to eat like fast food on the drive. So 
Like we'll get Chipotle if it's a really long drive because then it's like a meal, but we always do a sandwich. Um, usually we do turkey and cheese, but we're doing chicken salad. And then we always take a, really? <laughs> We take a salty snack. So this this trip we got space balls, and then keep in mind this is only an eight-hour drive. And then we always do a bar for like breakfast. I mean it's not really breakfast, but we have a bar, and then we always take a sweet snack, usually being dried mangoes. And I got another bag of these pancakes to take to my dad, so we can make them there. And then we also have cold brew that Ben made last night instead of like stopping and getting coffee. Sometimes we'll get like canned cold brew, but then you typically have to buy it black and like black cold brew in a can just isn't great. I wanted to show you guys what I'm putting in this. We're also making dinner. So some of this I was cutting for dinner, but we have like a third or so of a rotisserie chicken left and I'm just doing red onion. This is like the complex version. Sometimes I'll do it a little bit simpler than this, but red onion, um, two stalks of celery, some Dijon, mayonnaise. I just use like the real deal stuff because I can't stand the taste of like healthy mayonnaise. I think it just tastes like oil. And then some sweet pickles and apple. I wouldn't do apple since we're doing pickles, but Ben wants Dang both. And then I'm also doing pecans, salt, pepper, and a little garlic salt. So, and it is amazing. So it's all done. Looks so good. Doing it on this bread. I don't love Dave's bread anymore. I used to really like it. But I like to kind of go for like a regular bread. Like if I'm eating a car sandwich, I want like a car sandwich. You know what I mean? And this is a good one for that. So, and I'm bending all of it. Wow. vlog yesterday. Yesterday was our first full day here, but I did wedding stuff on my computer all day and then spent like the entire evening putting Chelsea's gift together for her shower tomorrow. I made, I was going to just do like a standard photo album, but I only had like a hundred photos and I couldn't find a good photo album that like wouldn't be awkwardly empty with only a hundred photos. So I ended up making her a scrapbook and it's so cute. Now it is Friday. Um, it's Friday early afternoon. Me and my dad are about to head up to a winery in Lewisburg. It's called Union Cellars. That's where we're doing our post rehearsal like dinner. So we're getting catered Italian, going to a winery, and that's our Thursday night situation. But we're gonna go check out the space and just see how we want it to be laid out because it's like a private event and also taste some wine. So we can choose like which wines are served that night. And then I have to stop and get a dress at this boutique in Lewisburg, it's called Daisy Lace. And I don't have an outfit for Chelsea shower tomorrow, so I need to find something. Obviously today, my next best option in this area is Target. So if I don't find something at this boutique, I have to go to Target later. I have a cute, cute little fit. Jeans, this bodysuit is from Abercrombie. I talk about it all the time because it's the best bodysuit ever. I wear it like too much. And then I have these white sneakers on actually from the boutique that I'm going to. And yeah, just comfy, cute fit. The, the weather here has been a 12 out of 10 and I'm like, I need to bottle this weather up and open the bottle on our wedding day because if I could draw up the most perfect wedding weather, it would be how it is right now. It's been so nice. And I feel like I haven't vlogged here in years this is the bedroom this is my childhood bedroom this is like the house i grew up in so um i used to vlog in here all the time when i would come home for the summers but yeah this is the the view oh god that was my phone the view out of my bedroom we have our pool little neighborhood my mom used to live up on that hill because when my parents got divorced my dad stayed and my mom moved up there like out of town. This is my childhood bedroom view. I'll go fill my water, heading to the winery. My camera's dead, so I'll vlog a little bit on my phone. It hasn't been charging right. Like the other night when I charged it, it didn't charge, which is why I also haven't been vlogging. But I'm gonna charge it now, figure it out, and yeah, 
let's go to the 